Hey, Ma. I just started college. It's really hard here. But I can't stop crying because I miss home so much. When I was recruited to play college baseball, they didn't say anything about Beast. The seniors who are running Beast haze me every chance they get. Yesterday at lunch, I got hazed by 10 of them before I got a chance to eat. I'm having trouble adjusting to life at West Point. Please send food, anything. Mama, mama, can't you see? Mama, mama, can't you see? What this army's done to me? What this army's done to me? Mama, mama, can't As a freshman, mama, or plebe, I'm only allowed to have four responses. Yes, sir. No, sir. No excuse, sir. Sir, I do not understand. In the hallways of the dorm, I'm only allowed to walk against the walls. I have to square every corner. Every single freaking corner. I have to memorize plebe knowledge. All kinds of knowledge. Like, how's the cow? Black dealer. Black dealer fluid. The daily menus. Chicken chow mein, steamed rice. MacArthur's duty on our country speech. And knowledge about leadership. Like Schofield's definition of discipline. Discipline which makes the soldiers of a free country. It's a hard one. Outside my room, I'm only allowed to look straight ahead. Beast fucks with your mind and body. Beast makes you wonder why the hell it is that you went to West Point in the first place. This is my Beast squad leader, Cadet Ransom. In 10 months, he'll graduate and be a lieutenant. Maybe he'll write a novel or teach English after the army. Who knows? You'd have come crying to me wanting to quit. There's good news. We won't let you quit until the three-week mark because we don't trust you, P-Braves, to see the big picture. <laughs> they even dictate when you're allowed to quit? This place is something else. The discipline which makes soldiers reliable in battle is not to be gained by harsher tyrannical treatment. Uh close, but not close enough, Gailey. You've had three days to get Schofields right. Are you blowing me off? No, sir. You better find a way to find the right synapses in your head, Gailey, or else you're going to have one long, miserable year. It is up to you. I could have played baseball for any college. But West Point was about chasing greatness. Making history. You looking to buy the place, Gailey? No, sir. Gailey, you having a good time at Beast? Everything's a goddamn joke to you. I should have read the fine print. Give me Schofield, numb nuts. Sir, Schofield's definition of discipline. The discipline that makes the soldiers- Cease okay. work! It's which makes the soldiers, Gailey, not that makes the soldiers. Ah, oh, Christ. Yes, sir. Your lack of attention to detail is disturbing. One day you're gonna get your troops killed. You know why, dirtbag? Because you're gonna position the blast side of a claymore mine against the enemy and blow up your troops. Really? I say that instead of which and now I kill all my troops? Yes, sir. Ma, Ransom has it out for me. Nothing I do is good enough. Don't give me that, Bo Gassity! You're moving like molasses, new cadet! I wonder what he was like as a plebe. For this moment, all my life. Oh, no. I wonder what he's like as a human being. Oh, no. I wonder what he's going to be like as a platoon leader. It's the third week, Ma. By the end of the week, we're allowed to resign. Really don't know what to do, Ma. Really don't know what to do. Still, reciting the days reminds me that Beast is only the beginning. There are 52 and a butt days until ring weekend for the class of 1988. There are 65 and a butt days until Army defeats Holy Cross at Mikey Stadium in football. There are 144 and a butt days until Army beats the hell out of Navy at Veterans Memorial Stadium in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in football.
there are 163 in a bunch of days until Christmas leave for the United States Corps of Cadets. There are 204 in a butt days until 500th night. There are 213 in a butt days until yearling winter weekend. There are 225 in a butt days until 500th night. Sir, may I make a correction? When are you going to get this right? Make it! There are 225 in a butt days until 100th night. There are 239 in a butt days until spring leave for the upper three classes. There are Sir, may I make a correction? You're about to break. I can feel it. Missing mommy and daddy. Want to be back home, back on the block smoking and joking with all your buddies? No, sir. I have a thing for jocks like you who are just playing cadet. Buying time before baseball starts so you can avoid the responsibilities the rest of us cadets have to do. Getting over on those of us who want to be here. You have no military bearing. You are always falling out. You wear your emotions on your sleeve. I thought there was no crying in baseball. Fireball first, sir. Don't you walk away from me. Get back here, smack. Gailey, get back here. Gailey. You belligerent. Sir. Schofield's definition of discipline. What? The discipline which makes the soldiers of a free country reliable in battle must not be gained by harsh or tyrannical treatment. Cease work, new cadet. On the contrary, such treatment is far more likely to destroy than to make an army. It is possible to impart instruction and give commands in such manner, in such a tone of voice, to inspire in the soldier no feeling but an intense desire to obey. The fuck do you think you're doing? But the opposite manner and tone of voice cannot fail to excite strong resentment and a desire to disobey. The one mode or the other of dealing with subordinates springs from a corresponding spirit in the breast of the commander. You insubordinate little dweeb. I'm going to be on your ass all year long. This is far from over, mister. He who feels the respect which is due to others cannot fail to inspire in them regard for himself, while he who feels disrespect toward others, especially his inferiors, cannot fail to inspire hatred against himself. Smooth move, Gailey.